Okay, after the insanity of the end of episode four of the second season of Jiu-Jitsu Kaisen, we're into um, episode five. And I can already see just from the opening screen, it says one year later. So um, I'm assuming we're still not going to see uh, young Yuji and his team, his crew, but uh, I'd be interested to see what happens next. feel like I'm in a better place with this show than I was, and that's a good thing. So episode five, let's go. Automated what he used to do manually, so obviously we kind of saw him turn into what was basically a god at the end of the last episode in terms of his ability and the purple hole or something. I can't remember. Purple something. Where he, it was mad. Uh, and now he's at the point where he can automatically determine between a, a threat and a non-threat, that being an eraser, rubber as we call it over here, and a pencil. Interesting. Okay, so keep it running the whole time. She's worried that'll fry his brain. I would have thought it would have been put it into like kind of an automatic place, but you know, whatever. But he's also running the reverse curse technique at the same time, assuming to kind of balance and heal his brain at the same time. So he can also activate multiple instances of blue and red simultaneously. I mean, he's been working, he's been, he's been working. I mean, expansion and teleportation over long distances still to be figured out. I'm interested, how do they train? So we saw in the first season a little bit of um, the guy sparring before the inter-school a tournament battle whatever you want to call it and that was interesting but you know the, the the sort of attunement to their skills is incredible and it's explained within the text i guess you want to call it they get better they develop these skills over time and that's why they're in this school and there's not really any classes that we've seen i guess there was a bit early on where uh itadori where yuji had to kind of attune his skills when he sat next to that weird thing and it beat him up every time that i can't quite remember what happened there that was weird i'm always fascinated by Training of skills is something I'm fascinated by anyway, but especially in the world. I mean, obviously, this is magic, but there are clear parallels with combat and martial arts. It's kind of all really the same thing and attunement of techniques and perception of the environment and all this sort of stuff. But I'm very interested in outside of this um, anime world. Oh, so every time he's swallowing or absorbing one of those cursed spirits, it's like eating a rag of shit and vomit. Okay, interesting. I mean, I don't know if that's a metaphorical statement or if it literally tastes like that. Probably a bit of both. Okay, so he's just... There we go. There we go. That was the moment. Gito san. Hi, Baro. Otsukore samo desu. Amai no to shoppai no dotchi ga ii desu ka? Salty stuff all day. Satoru mo taberu ka mo shirenai kara amai no kana? Liokai desu. Jibun wa amari monogoto o fukaku kangae nai tachi na node. Jibun ni dekiru koto o seippai ganbaru no wa kimochi ga ii desu. So ka. そうだな。君がゲトウ君どんな女がタイプかな後輩素直で可愛いじゃないか。術師としてはもっと人を疑うべきかと。どちら様特級術師つくもゆきって言えばわかるかな。あなたがあの。いいね。ユキよ。特級のくせに任務を全く受けず海外をプラプラしてる六でなしに私光線的嫌いすると呪霊の生まれない世界の作り方は二つ一全人類から呪力をなくす全人類に呪力の可能にさせる一はね結構いい線行くと思ったんだ
呪力を完全に捨て去ることで肉体は一瞬隠し逆に呪いの体勢を得たんだよ彼はまさに超人負けたことは恥じなくていい、oh, yeah, course, 彼を研究したかったが OK、so it's not eliminating mankind or might turn into that, making it possible for all of humanity to control their cursed energy. Now there we go. So eliminate non Jujutsu sorcerer mankind. All the repeating of the, the shower okay, so a, sort of a forcing of evolution then through culling. It sounds. Pretty damn genocidal to me. Jacksha Yueno Totosa, Jacksha Yueno Minixa, Son of Humbest to Juyo at the Kinakna Tishmatiru. He just show me could as a gentleman wild as the girl just turned up like this. I mean, I feel like there might be something deeper going on of her just sudden appearance, really sowing the seeds, or perhaps the seeds have already been sown and she's watering them so they bloom in his mind. Jane, Honto, a good joke in my sat is the cut again. まが悪かったようだ。さとるには私から言っておきます。あ、そうだ。最後に聖書隊のことは気にしなくていい。あの時もう一人別の聖書隊がいたか。すでに新しい聖書隊が生まれたのか。どちらにせよ天元は安定し
もし私が君になれるのならこの馬鹿げた理想も地にあっ<笑>殺したければ殺せ。Unless you can. I mean, you are Gojo. それには意味がある先生、俺強いよね。はあ、生意気にもな。でも、俺だけ強くてもダメらしいよ。何をかけて、他人に言うと、バレる準備があるやつだけだ。Very philosophical this episode. Kito Sama. Yoko Mita, I said. To say the kiddies, Kak Shibucho, I hear your queen, Kaicho, Sonoka Fotokako, sorry, de. Komani Mastane. So da. The fucking music's like tap dancing or clapping or something. It's very intense. So da, sir. As he goes to the dictator. そうあなたですさて改めて猿は嫌い私に従え自分の力にも気づいてるんじゃない全員家は才能大好き術式を自覚するのが大体4から6歳バイバイのタイミングとしてはベターだよねめぐみくんはさ君のお父さんが全員家に対して取っておいた最高のカードだったんだよムカつくでしょう積み木の母親も少し前から帰ってないあめぐみ帰ってきたもう俺たちは用済みであとは任せなさい、うん、でもめぐみくんには多少無理してもらうかも頑張ってね強くなってよ僕に置いていかれないくらい OK レクルーメンダン All right, now, so we were 2007 and now we're at 2018. So we're going to see the crew. We haven't seen them for ages. There they are. Okay. Right, so I guess we're now moving back into the story that we came for in the first place. But given the, the happenings of the movie, and given the fact that Ghetto is obviously the, the cut up、uh, bad guy from the first season, I think、uh, we're going to be getting some serious clashes. And yeah, I think taking your advice, a lot of you guys' advice, and when it gets complicated, Pausing it, taking each sentence in it at a time.、It's, it does help my understanding of the show so much more. And I think I was overestimating, like I said in the previous video, overestimating my ability to follow、um, at that speed what was going on. Just because I was able to read it literally, wasn't able to take it all in and watch the animation. Very keen to see where we go next because there's so much that hasn't been spoken about for a while, namely Sukuna and the Fingers. I mean, that was the central. Theme of the show, the central driving force of the plot, and we haven't seen or spoken about that for fucking ages. I mean, ages. I mean, I've seen Human Centipede 1.、Um, a dreadful film. A truly dreadful film. I'm amazed that they made more of them. But I guess that's the world we live in at the moment. Listen, this, this sounds like the fucking best film of all time. Way better than Human Centipede. あなたは誰よりも人間だわ。怪物だ、殺せ。ケビンやめて、殺したら私たちが怪物だわ。ケビン。特急は術師の格付けの中で斜めに外れた位置づけじゃ。一級こそ他の術師、ひいては呪術界を牽引していく存在だとわしは考えておる。<笑>危険、機密、法級、順位。New rule for me. When it gets complicated and expositional, 
I pause to take it in. Right, so the first grades must stand above comparison to semi-first grades in terms of peril, secrecy and salary. How would I get paid? I thought they were students. I guess the teachers don't. Oh, students. I mean, I can't believe I just said that out loud. Oh, yeah, it's my brother. Ah, okay. So, promotion time. Now, if we're going to have a sport episode, but the sport is table tennis, ping pong, then I'm all here for it. My favorite sports. Love ping pong. So, I can follow this one better. Baseball, don't, I just literally, I've never watched a baseball game in my life, so it's just fucking lost on me. I mean, I know the basic rules. You'll need to go on more dangerous missions to raise the chances of finding more fingers. So we're back into the central thrust of the show. Okay, I'm up for that. I'm up for those two have missions together, so Toto can do that like teleporting thing. And obviously uh, Yuji's got uh, his old fucking gamut of uh, powers and probably more to come. Destiny. <laughs> Ah, いたとりくんを推薦したのは私たちだから彼が同行するのは私たち以外の術師だよこれ中学卒業式の時の私ですえマジ半年前でしょ何がどうしたのいやその時から身長だけ 私、あの、まずはそいつに話を聞きましょう。あの。もし釘崎さんもいたどりくんのことない。天地がランバダを踊っても。ない。実はこの子がカクカクしかじかで。つまりそういうことか。<笑> ええ、そういうことよ。彼女はまずいないだろう。根拠は急に東京来るってなって特に困ったようすなかったし。あと部屋にグラビアポスターが貼ってある。彼女いるやつってそういうの貼らねえんじゃねえか背が高い子が好き
<laughs> Worst animation of all time. <laughs> so I knew I knew this was gonna happen. It doesn't look like we're having a complete rug pull, I guess we'll see. But there's some cursed energy situation going on there with that girl. There's no two ways about it. こっちよ。ご城から内通者の話は聞いてるわね。はい。多分受訴した通じてるのは2人以上。で、京都の誰ですか?うん?私たち東京側に頼むってことはそういうことでしょ。首先すげえな。内通者は。猫丸。ああ
odd dating stuff at the beginning, which I can only assume is going to lead somewhere. But it was also a decent reintroduction to the characters without it being straight into the action. <laughs> Right. So his victory condition is Satoru Gojo, so he needs to get in contact with Gojo. I mean, you've just okay. You survived it. You've just smashed a dam. Isn't that gonna like flood the city? Or uh, it doesn't matter, does it? All you appear to be doing is smashing up a dam. これを あれ。どう。どういうことだ。魂ごと破壊された。ま、そう ま、人対策もしっかりしてきたわけだ。ビジョン。ビオラ。ビジョンビオラ。Mad for my eyes. Oh, you've really fucked up that dam now. Oof. Uh oh. Do you have hands inside his mouth? Self embodiment of perfection, domain expansion. So weird. あの it's a means for them to protect themselves from others. He's back up. Oh, I mean, it's not looking good for Mahit. Even if it is a simple activate inside a domain, it's guaranteed here. The damage will hit it regardless of any technique. He said, I'll be able to see everyone. Oh. oh no. Oh no. He is not dead. 
By the way, this is one of the maddest things I've ever seen in my life. I mean, I'm trying to keep up with it as best I can, but it's just a fucking absolute assault on the eyes and senses. Super spectacular. Very enjoyable. I mean, this is wild, isn't it? Like, true combination of crazy art, crazy violence, mad moments, fucking an absolute, absolute onslaught of information. Right, Nakamura is a bunch of hands now. Stick him, stick him, stick him. Oh, that doesn't look good. なんか良くなりすぎると、いなくなったときつらいもんね。よっしゃ、ニアンドリータイプ。でも私は今のみんなとの関係が好き。ほら、メカマルは野球を参加できなかったでしょ?だから。Chill I'm not sure why, but you know, I'm doing my domain after that would make him think I was dead, right? It's all calculated. It wasn't dangerous at all. Well, there's another use of a simple toy. I think we got to see it in action before the main event. Ah, so it's Halloween, right. Yeah, too busy. Alright, down comes the veil. So, 14 minutes past 8 in Shibuya. Same time, Shibuya Mark City Restaurant Avenue entrance outside the veil. <laughs> this is what they all said when they came to the end of the veil, right? Interesting. So, Team Zenin. いえ、皆さんはまだここで待機っす。高度な結界術に五条悟を指名したこと、去年のクリスマスの百鬼アポート違って、もう事は起こっちまってる。俺もこれが最善だと思う。それに、さっき飛ばりの内側を見てきたが